गुड मॉर्निंग शेम स्टार्स इन प्रीवियस वीडियो ऑफ चैप्टर इलेवन वर्क एंड एनर्जी वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट वर्क एंड वर्क डन बाय अ कॉन्स्टेंट फोर्स इन दिस प्रजेंटेशन वी विल लर्न अबाउट एनर्जी एंड डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ एनर्जी द टर्म एनर्जी इज वेरी फ्रिक्वेंटली यूज बाय अस लाइफ इज इम्पॉसिबल विदाउट एनर्जी In science the word energy has a definite and precise meaning in the language of science anything having a capability to do work is said to possess energy energy exists in many forms energy can be moved from one object to another energy can be changed from one form to another energy cannot be created or destroyed In nature energy exists in different forms the various forms include mechanical energy which is sum of potential energy and kinetic energy heat energy chemical energy electrical energy and light energy as we know mechanical energy is further divided in two forms kinetic energy and potential energy energy due to motion in an object is called kinetic energy kinetic energy can change into other forms of energy this slide shows some examples of kinetic energy moving vehicles like car buses trucks trains and flying aircrafts possess kinetic energy of moving bullet a falling apple or coconut a moving stone and a moving ball all possess kinetic energy due to the state of motion let's understand potential energy the energy possessed by a body due to its change in position or shape is called the potential energy now let's understand with some examples a stretched or the compressed spring has potential energy due to change in its size A stretched bow has potential energy due to change in its configuration as shown in this uh, slide the stored potential energy of a bow is used to supply kinetic energy to arrow and as a result the arrow has a large range an object may simultaneously possesses potential energy as well as kinetic energy and some of these energies is called the total mechanical energy of the object a flying bird a flying kite an aircraft in flight a vehicle running on a hilly track etc have potential energy as well as kinetic energy now let's talk about units of energy as energy possessed by an object is measured in terms of its capacity of doing work the unit of energy is same as that of work the si unit of energy is joule 1 joule of energy is the energy required to do 1 joule of work so children this is all about the introduction of energy and different types of energy in the next presentation we will talk about law of conservation of energy thank you shem stars that's all for today you can drop your queries on google classroom take care